Hey, how's it going on guys? In this video, we're going to find out what query set is in Django. And if you're new to Django, you must have come across these two words, query set and model instance. So we are going to talk about query set first, and then finally we will um, check the differences between those two items, okay? So let's find out the query set first. Let's say we have a database and we are going to perform a query. And let's assume that we have a model called supplier and through these objects through this manager we are going to grab all the suppliers so we are going to have a list of suppliers right and that list is not going to be called a list it is going to be called a query set hmm. now why is this called query set why not list that is the million dollar question it is because let me show you you have to watch that carefully i'm trying to print my query set and what does it give me it gives me a complex data type look at this the type of the data these are called complex data types so whenever you query into your database the database will give you a list if it gives you a list that list is gonna give you a complex data type it is not neither uh, python dictionary nor json not like the plain python dictionary okay since this is gonna give you a complex data type these data types are often called query set so that is it okay that's query set but do not stop watching the video because you are going to find out more and uh, so what can i do with this query set uh, you need to serialize this query set because you cannot directly send this query set uh, to web page because the web page is not going to render this query set so first you have to uh, serialize it and through this serialization you will have that python dictionary and then later this python dictionary can be converted into json okay guys so yeah so that's query set and now we want to find out what model instance is um well you i'm sure that you understand model right model is like a like a whole entire table but when you get one item from that table not like two items just only one item one object that is going to be called as model instance but let me explain to you in detail okay so same database we are going to perform a query and look at this this time our manager is going to filter uh, whose id is one so it is going to uh, bring me one single supplier not the uh, like two suppliers or the uh, like the whole list of suppliers okay so this is going to bring me one supplier this is called model instance so when you grab only one single item from your entire table that instance or that object is called model instance so still it is a, a complex data type it is not neither dictionary nor json it is a uh, new serialization it needs serialization to and you need to convert um, uh, this uh, to python dictionary and later also you have to convert this into json and you can send it to web and web will be uh, rendering this um, json easily so yeah that is the difference between the query set and model instance guys uh, so yeah fair enough um, if you think that video is good um, then yeah hit the like button and uh, do subscribe to my channel i would really really appreciate that guys thank you very much i'll see you in the next video take care bye bye ta ta